understand that you knew Carol personally. Susan, can you tell us about Carol Shields, what she was like? Carol was um, an amazing woman because she'd been brought up in this genteel suburb of Oak Park in Chicago. It's the same suburb that Hemingway was brought up in. And she had a kind of quiet life there. She said that she never met a black or Jewish person in the suburb. She was very sheltered and she, you know, she was sorry about that, but that was just how it was. Um, and when she went to Hanover College, an arts college, she won the first prize for fiction at the college. And the, um, but she didn't get to keep it. She um, was told that the runner up who was in second place was a male student and he needed the prize money because he was going to go on and raise a family. This is true. And would Carol give the prize to him? And of course, like the well brought up lady she had been, was taught to be, she agreed. So it's very kind of ironic to compare how, you know, Hemingway was immediately successful when he left Oak Park and went off into the world and to write about war and he was immediately successful. Carol's life was a slow build to a real literary success where she won many, many prizes. And of course, as a, an older woman writer, a veteran, she didn't uh, put up with any nonsense. She was very kind. She was very uh, loving actually, but she had no time um, for her male compadres who would boast. I remember standing in a group with her once and, and uh, she and I were in this sort of very interesting conversation about a book and a male writer came up to her, came up to both of us and just broke in and interrupted as if we were saying nothing of any importance. And, and she turned to him and she said, you know, I no longer have to put up with this kind of arrogance. And then she quickly, quietly walked away. She didn't say it in a harsh tone. She said it in this, you know, kind of soft speaking voice that she had. And he was flabbergasted. So I remember thinking at the time, you know, she, she may be kind um, and supportive, but she is nobody's fool and she doesn't like fools either. So <laughs> she, she made that clear to me that day. And um, the other thing I can say about her is that she mentored a lot of women. And she mentored me. Uh, she was very kind to me. And, uh, you know, the prize, she embodies the spirit of the prize, which is women helping women. 